Hello everyone, welcome back. We've had a little break over uh, Christmas and New Year. Hope you all had a good holidays and all that good stuff. I've been on vacation and I've had a nice break. And we're back starting the New Year well, although I am like three days late to the New Year. Um, check this out in the bottom left. In three days, the game gets fully released, version 1.0. Now this might sound kind of stupid because obviously I didn't make the game or have any um, part in making the game or anything like that. But it's a pretty big moment, uh, really, for me because that's what started the channel, this game. And it's gonna be version one in three days. So I'm quite excited. Uh, the version one is gonna be releasing with like a hundred and something Steam achievements. And obviously I've got a 100% the game. So we're gonna be aiming to uh, get all those Steam achievements in the next few weeks. But for now, I think we're just gonna chill, try and win as many floors as we can, you know, start on floor one over, and then over the next few days, see uh, how many floors we can win. So we've got three days. I hate all of these already. Um, feels good though, honestly. Feels good to be back. I think a nice break is uh, refreshed. Just just refresh my mind a little bit, you know, give me a bit of time to chill. Um, I've already said no to one goldfish. I'll add one. Okay. Uh, but it just feels good to be back. Like, it's, it's amazing what it does. Um, although it also does mean that I'm back to work, which maybe I'm not so happy about. Uh, I'm actually gonna ignore this because I always take this um, and it also always gives it me as the first item um, So I'm gonna go for guillotine instead, which I know is pronounced guillotine. God, this is <laughs> Already loads of uh, flashbacks happening in this episode um, I'll take an anchor for now. It's just a bit of fun, isn't it? Hopefully it gets in the corner at least once before we remove it We've already got one crab, so we're gonna add a second. So I think as soon as we beat the floor here We're just gonna oh third crab we're just going to move on to floor two and then we'll do that you know until i feel like the video should end and then we'll carry on again tomorrow and then we'll carry on going and then the game will come out version one with all of its achievements that we are gonna find and complete and we're gonna 100 percent the game and then i think we'll start playing with some mods again because i don't want to do mods now i know we've got like three days so i could have like a good three days of mods but i want to sink a lot of time into the mods for this game um and i've got a feeling that when you have mods enabled uh steam achievements will be disabled like every other game ever made um so that's my thinking got banana got a monkey right now i do like i think i'm just gonna add wine i know i could add milk for the cat but i do like wine free value i've skipped a few dwarves already i've got a goldfish who can destroy bubbles which i've kind of never really used i don't think as a mechanic so we're going to try it now we're going to pay 100 with 98 spare okay oh okay i could add a third bear but we've got no honey for a while at least until we get guaranteed rare picks then we can either find honey or beehives uh so i'm going to add the billionaire because he will get guillotined there you go did i say it correctly for all you People, if you wonder why I say it um, incorrectly to you, maybe. Um, oh, I could get another goldfish. No, I don't want to do that. Though we would get more money from the bubbles, but there's only like two bubbles left. Um, I say it incorrectly because that's just how I was brought up to say it, if you know what I mean. We've got fruit baskets. Orange is going to be free value here. Fruit basket with Ricky the banana would make bananas for value, but I don't think that's something that I really want to do. Okay, there go both bubbles. I guess the goldfish didn't really have much of an impact there. Coconut's going to be two value. I kind of wish I had a monkey now, but I've already skipped one of those. Yeah, we can afford to take an essence capsule. Oh man, I'm so excited for the release of this game. You have no idea. I just want that like 100% completed thing on my Steam page. You know, like, ah, I, I, I did think about like speed running all the achievements, but honestly with work and stuff, I just don't have time. Um, So I will not be the first as much as I'd like to. But also I'd like to... I could do it and then like release it in episodes of daily anyway, maybe, but then I wouldn't, well, I would be the first, but I wouldn't be first publicly until, do you know what I mean? And then oh, I don't care. I don't know. It's weird. Um, we'll take sunglasses essence and we'll take, uh, yeah, we'll take bowling ball essence for a bit of, you know, passive income for a bit. We'll take a lucky capsule because we, we actually are after, I think we're after honey. I did think about more crabs, which is kind of making me take away from Lucky Cat, but we do still find common with Lucky Cat. It's not that, you know, it's not that um, strong of a rare 
boost. Amethyst. It's been a while since I've done a build like this, which I think I do want to do, but this is going to be for the achievement runs, I imagine, or the big runs like this and geologist runs and stuff. Um, I'm going to get another lockbox because as soon as we get a key, we've got like three things that need to be opened. I suppose I could start removing some stuff here. That would be two value. No, thanks. I'm going to use removal. I'm not going to use removal token because we're actually on 20 symbols. Okay. To add a few more things then before I can remove stuff. Coconut half will be free value thanks to the fruit basket. Uh, and I'm going to remove the coin right now. We obviously want to get rid of the flower. The shiny pebble I'm not too fond of. The pearl. Okay, chemical seven. I mean, I like the crabs, but... I don't, I don't really know where this is going to go. I think we'll win this run pretty uh, easily. It's floor one. Um, I think we'll probably win most of them pretty easily until we get up to like the, the nine range, maybe. Um, void stone. Although, didn't they decrease the difficulty of nine? Hmm. Okay, I definitely... I think we'll take this, but I'll turn it off because I don't want to have a rabbit um, or rabbit fluff added every 10 spins. Okay, another billionaire that can be guillotined. Let's go. Are the comments actually going to like, you know, slowly over time, just make me change the way I say that? Because I'm like, now I'm trying to say it the way that everyone wants me to. Uh, we're going to change my vocabulary, guys. Let's add a key. Okay, I mean, that's how that happens, right? People get jobs and stuff in areas and then they move to different towns and they start talking like other people and they change their accent and their pronunciation of a lot of words um i'm happy about any of those we got rid of was it one of the lock boxes or was it the safe second chemical seven okay i suppose a bronze arrow could have been quite good there but leaves me one chemical seven away from free and i am a big fan of the chemical sevens so we pay 300 for 192 spare i'm gonna take comfy pillow essence and probably use it i'm gonna take fish tank essence because i think that's gonna get rid of the goldfish. Oh, Max with the bear is obviously incredible, but conveyor belt is too good of a chance to skip. So that's got rid of the goldfish, which would have destroyed the bubbles, which is a shame. But I guess at least we got rid of the goldfish now without using a removal token. Not that that's like a really difficult thing, because obviously we've we've got a lot of removal tokens because it's floor one. Um, but still, okay, I could get another billionaire. I'm going to get a key though to open the other lockbox. I think the safe's been opened already, so. Okay, we can get a dwarf to drink the wine. We've got a conveyor belt as well, so a bartender could be pretty good here. Okay, uh, I mean, just a wealthy capsule. I think void fruit only gives seven, so that's more worthy to me. Our bowling ball essence is gone. Oh, 350 and two spins. Skip two spins to get a very rare item. Absolutely. So that's comfy pillow essence. Oh, I am going to take this for a little bit. Okay. So all of these things, so Thief, Billionaire, uh, Chemical 7, so any like consumables, I guess. Wealthy Capsule, Present, TDM Capsule, Lord of the Void, Creature Fruit and Stone, Gambler, all the chests, the target, have a 50% chance of being added when destroyed. So I guess you could like technically destroy this and there's a chance it will come back. So you can destroy it again. And then there's another 50% chance. It can happen seven times. Okay, I do really like Dwarven Anvil, but this is a very rare item. I can't say no to it. Okay, nice. Keys just opened two lock boxes, and I think they both came back and it got opened again. Is that what just happened? I'm having on toddler roots and open yard. I'll take a billionaire though. And it just happened then as well. Oh my god, that is so strong. <laughs> that is ridiculously strong. Oh my bro. It just happened like four times. <laughs> with a billionaire <gasps> can we actually make it get to seven that would be incredible seven is the limit of how many times it can do it we can add a goldfish because we've got the essence nice oh i'd love to see it happen seven times oh that'd be incredible happened four and it was like you know had me proper impressed we'll get a bubble because a bubble can burst right no i don't think a bubble's part of it no it's not okay Chemical seven. Oh, it'd be good for chemical seven, wouldn't it? Imagine if the chemical seven did it four times. We'd get two, two, um, 77 golds. Mobius strip essence destroys itself after seven of these things are destroyed. When destroyed, they give 1.5 times more. Okay. Well, that seems 
incredibly strong. Um, destroy itself, there are at least three bears. Okay, we're on two bears at the minute. An item capsule. We're going to take coin and a string to try to get rid of some of these common, sorry, uncommon items, I guess. Okay, so I kind of want things to just get destroyed now. Was time cap time capsule's not on there, is it? No, it's just a wealthy capsule and a tedium capsule. I think anything that gives money. Um, okay. We've obviously still got a lot of things we need to get rid of. We should probably check how many symbols that we're on. I'm going to have to add... Wine's not on there, is it? Why isn't wine on there? I guess it's not really... A, well, it is a consumable. I'm going to add a lockbox just for the fun of it. I was going to add wine, but... Definitely the lockbox in the safe and all that kind of stuff is more fun because it can come back several times. We'll get a lucky capsule because I'd still be down for a bartender or even better, to be honest, a beehive. I don't think time capsule does anything, but it will. Or so it doesn't have anything to do with <gasps> the Mobius strip, but it does add a key, which will now open the safe. So the lock boxes. Come on. There's a chance here for it to go seven times. That would clean up the crabs, but I don't really want that. I'm going to get a key instead. So we've got two keys on the board now. There goes one. Oh my god. Okay. I think like two of them came back twice, but still, it's a lot of money. And that one came back three times, unless that one was the safe. Oh, that's incredible. Oh my god. I've never actually utilized this item before this many times. And now, I believe the essence has been used. So like those things will now give us more money. So when we add them, we should see like a little 1.5 multiplier next to their names. Cow does add milk, and we have got convey but i might just add it anyway because it looks good uh looting glove oh my god okay obviously i want to have an anvil again but yet again i've got i've just there's a better alternative the looting glove this works so well with the mobius strip synergy we got going on right gives more money and it already gives more money i'm gonna add another crab okay let's get rid of the flower um we've still got cherries to get rid of and stuff well they are worth two so the pearl actually needs to go first and probably some of those We've got two anchors on the board. We've got a lot of rubbish symbols on the board, but... Okay, there's a lockbox. Okay, so that should have a 1.5 times multiplier on it. Okay, nice. Just to find ways to open these things now. Um, I could, honestly, lockpick would be like... You know, superior. But I think we need a key next to it for it to like keep spamming open, of course. Because lockpick is only like a 30% chance of... Actually opening it. Where a key being next to it is 100%. Also, if it was a magic key and a mega chest and it happened like a million times. <laughs> okay. Nice. I mean, I could just add milk, but we've got a cow doing it now and there's like a cat on the board. It's, it's, it's a very weird build. Oh, hang on. We pay 625. We've only got 27 spare. Oh, no. Oh, no. What have I done? Uh, rusty gear essence. Yes. Okay. Magic key is definitely a yes. Any more good ones here? Uh, we'll take black pepper. I'm going to use removal token to get rid of the pearl. And that's right. I said and. The cherries are worth two. So I'm going to get rid of the shiny pebble and the dwarf. Okay, so no more beers or anything being added. Okay, milk's been drank by the cat. Rusty gears multiplied the crabs. There is a third bear, which should toggle Goldilocks to give us, is it 50 gold? Okay, quite a lot either way. Um, I'm a bit struggling now. I think a lockbox opened, but I missed it because our key's gone. Um, no more anchors. I could start re-rolling, to be honest, but we're going to need money at some point. Oh, no. Okay, removal capsule I definitely don't need. Void fruit. Oh, no. Honestly, item capsule, what can you give me? Swear jar. Oh, no. Am I going to lose? I can't lose floor one. Okay, at least milk got drank by a cat, which is worth literally nothing. It's worth 10. I'm going to add another bear just for the fun of it at this point. Um, they're, they're worth one more, so it's like a free value symbol. But obviously, honey would make it extremely uh, valuable, which right now it isn't. So they're, they're worth three. If they eat honey, they're going to be worth like 70. Especially if we get Maxwell the bear later on as well. Okay, six, seven, five and two spins. It's going to be close, but I'm going to add a lucky capsule as well. Okay, I'm going to re-roll here. We're looking for a beehive. That doesn't really work with us, does it? So we're going to re-roll again. Joker doesn't really work me either. I need... I'm going to go tedium capture because I think that might spam a few times. Okay, it didn't. That's a shame. Um, we make 675 with 48 spare and 7 
seven seven is due in 10 spins i'm gonna re-roll here once again looking for i mean that would uh, i don't really want that though the sun honestly oh god this is bad i need to add something here we've got nothing that the sun can modify the only thing i can think of honestly is the witch multiplying the cap but that's not worth it to me either i should have probably just added it though i'm gonna go instant ramen I mean, we're on 19 okay maybe i'm like what happened a few times then we've got 33 gold from that tdm capsule being a little bit weird maybe that's what we need to do i mean i, I just need a key at this point and just let the lockbox open a million times i've got nothing to open the present although it could it would just break at zero but then it's not worth any money a monkey could come and eat the coconuts i'm gonna have to do it i need the money okay he ate like half a coconut and got us 19 gold oh no another crab i have to say yes to that i'm gonna get rid of some things though ah, i'm gonna get rid of the anchors first which i've just realized has significantly narrowed our board once the milk gets drank i don't need a second monkey oh i'm i am genuinely very nervous because i think i might mess this up by trying to be a a Mobius strip kind of guy. Um, we'll just add more milk for the sake of it because I mean, it's literally worth nothing as well. Like the cat, you know, there's no really huge benefits to having this. I could get several cats, but a third chemical seven gives us a third lucky seven, which gives us 77 gold, which could be the difference between winning and losing this floor one run. Oh dear, it's kind of embarrassing. Seven, seven, sevens during two spins. Honestly. I think without that 77 gold, we would have lost this genuinely because we would have to roll. Let's say we didn't have the 77 right now. We'd be on what? 693. So we would have to roll 783 to win this. No, it's completely wrong. 780. 780. 784. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, God. Okay, haven't been at work for a while. Let's go. Yeah, we make it with <laughs> nothing nothing spare. We pay 777 with 42 spare. Wait. Thank you for your final rent payment. Our apartment complex is being converted to a condominium. I know you can't afford the necessary down payments. So you are being evicted. I didn't know there was boss fights on floor one. Yo, I did not know there was boss fights on floor one. I thought it started on like nine or 15 even. Hello, your rent has increased to 1,000 and is due in 10 spins. Bruh. Okay, I'm going to get happy hour essence just in case we do get a bartender from anywhere. Um, okay. Um, honestly, this will give us 77. Let's just take it. We'll just be a little bit short for a little while. Uh, we'll get lemon. Okay, we'll also get big symbol bomb, which I'm actually going to use to add a key. And then I don't really want a beer because I haven't got anything to drink it anymore. I got rid of the dwarf. Just want a key to open the lockbox, please. Um, I have got a monkey still, so we'll add a coconut. Okay, I'm kind of feeling good about this. Oh, the four crabs in a row just got a lot of money. Nice one. 1,000 is due in eight spins. Very rare symbols give one less. That's a little bit toxic. Nice. Okay. We'll take it. We'll take it. I don't want any more monkeys. Thank you. Monkeys give 50% less gold. Oh, bro, I forgot how toxic this game is. How toxic the landlord is, even, I should say, with the little fine prints. 1,000 is due in six. Are we going to make 1,000? I suppose if we kill him first, it doesn't matter, does it? Because the rent payment will be abolished. We've just got to make 429 within five spins. Or we've got to make 1,000 in five spins. So we actually might be struggling here pretty soon. He gives 50% less money, so that's not a lot at all. Oh, no. I think we lose this. The guillotine has no effect. We genuinely lose this. I haven't got enough income. Oh, this is awful. 1,000 in free spins. Okay, that's been opened. It didn't... I was hoping it would respawn. I might have just saved us, though, to be honest. Oh, I don't know. 190 in two spins. I don't think we have a chance. We don't have a chance here unless we have some absolute insane. No, we lose. Oh my God. I can't. Hang on. How many spins has it been? How many spins? If we skip now, does it not? Do we not get this thing? Where is it? We've still got four more. Oh, I've got to add symbols. Oh, I'm an idiot. I thought it was just after seven spins. 
I thought it was after seven spins, it would give us 77, but no. I have to add seven to symbols. I've got nothing I can break or anything, have I? I fully destroyed this run. Oh, no. Oh, what have I done? Yeah, I mean, it was fun while it lasted, right? A key's not going to do anything here. Oh. I'm so dumb. We can't afford to pay the 1,000. I've got nothing to save me. I've actually just... Oh, hang on. Swear jar. Dead zero money in the swear jar. Oh, no. Oh, I can't believe that's just happened. I'm so bad at this game. <laughs> it's floor one. It's a floor one loss. Okay, I mean, listen, we've had a break, okay? We've been on vacation. We're chilling. It's the first recording back. Oh, dear. Okay. That is honestly embarrassing. I mean, listen, you've seen me beat the harder floors before, okay? And do weird things with the runs on this game. So, you're just going to have to, you know, I mean, you all believe that I'm a good player, right? Right? We had such a good setup there for, like, the bears. We had the bears. We had the the conveyor belt. We had the, the bartender and the happy hour essences and stuff. We had a few things, you know, kind of building towards a great run. I just didn't really do anything about it. I've got three light bulbs here. They're all multiplying. Yo. A pearl. I was going to get an oyster then to add more, but that's just stupid, isn't it? Because the light bulbs are temporary. We haven't got Mobius strip anymore, so that's not as satisfying as it once was but we pay 50 i think with 32 spare I quite like that we could get huston capsule to give us a pull ball early on but i'm going to take wine and i'm also going to take lock pick okay so no more keys that's quite nice i'm just going to get another light bulb for now they can just keep multiplying the pill for as long as they like maybe we'll get a different gem thing pretty soon i'm going to get cheese because we've got a mouse on the board already okay I can't believe I've actually choked this. I can't believe I've actually just misplayed so hard. It's fine though. This is a new run and we're going to win this one. Okay. I've got nothing to destroy any of those things. So a bubble it is. A little temporary symbol. Okay. I mean, oh, I, I really do want to stay away from these. I'm going to add a B because we can afford to remove stuff in on this floor. Which I think is what lost me the last floor. I didn't add enough stuff. I was playing quite safe and reserved. Thinking that I wasn't going to have the insane amounts of removal tokens i did have um because i'm so used to those higher up floors we're gonna take a bear i'm gonna take rusty gear okay so three or more yeah the same symbol are adjacent they give 2.5 times value it's got to be a ninja right we've got a mouse we could get a ninja mouse item pretty soon if we're lucky um i i could probably afford to add coal on this floor but then again i don't want to say anything now after the last run because i you know I said something about the last run and uh, we lost, so we'll see how we get on. Okay, milk's fine. Cat can drink that. There goes another light bulb. Of course, it can multiply shiny pebble. I don't need any keys. I don't think I want to re-roll, but I did it anyway. Five-sided dice isn't bad. Average roll of three. That'll be our second highest symbol, I guess, after the wine. We'll pay 150 with 51 spare. We're taking black cat. If we get 13 cats, we got money. Um, destroys itself if three or more birds are adjacent. Honestly, we'll take recycling, I guess. I'm going to re-roll here because I'm about to get more re-roll capsules. Okay, that's good for us, right? I do like Max with the bear because we've got a bear again. But I feel like the bear is like a long-term investment, right? Because it's not going to pay off till we get honey. And when are we going to get honey? A long time. <laughs> um, A long, long time time away okay be uh, it's got to be silver arrow i think that's just going to carry the run now though if it points to symbols of course um i'm going to add a third cat we've got black cat essence but no other cat items so these are still just one value for the time being which is a little bit scary now that i think of it especially if you had 13 of them and they're all one value uh so we may need to get pizza the cat and some other essences uh, soon we have got rusty gear which actually i'm not too um displeased if i love rusty gear so that's going to be good for the cats but obviously it's not too great just yet because they're only one value we'll get another chemical seven we'll get that could give us more cats but it's got to be conveyor belt i'm sorry um 
Okay, that would just multiply the cats to two value, which is still abysmal, um, which is why I need some kind of increased valuation. I really don't want to add a toddler because I always do toddler builds and candy builds, jack-o'-lantern. So I always hit jack-o'-lantern early, so I just... Okay, we'll get another bottle of wine. Probably remove some symbols soon. The coal's going to turn into a diamond. I want to keep the flower because of the bee. I don't really want to add another beer at this point, to be honest. It's one value. We haven't got anything to destroy it. A flower would have genuinely been more valuable because at least the flower could be multiplied by the bee. Hmm, okay. Do I want to remove anything? Honestly, I think... Let's go to the coin. Although the light bulb's going to remove itself any second on two spins. Well, no. And two spins in two interactions with... There you go. Some Some nice stones, I guess. Um, I've got a lock pick So a lock box is a good pick Probably going to get destroyed Straight away, there you go Silver arrow doesn't point towards it though So we miss out on a big multiplier there Bro Is floor 1 actually this hard? I wasn't even aware that was happening is it, I, I'm I'm amazed I'm truly amazed what's happened. I mean, I did have a piece of coal, right? Which isn't great. Um, I'm going to have to add one. I can't win without a toddler, I think. Let's pay 25 with two spare. I'm actually... I'm in a bad place right now. I've lost two floor one runs. Okay, I haven't got a mouse already. I'm going to take a crab. This could be a classic cultists and crab build. Um, I did add a toddler, so I'm going to go with candy. Oh, I hate myself. Does it actually take me adding a toddler to win? Like, the, the two runs when I literally like went out of my way to avoid toddlers, we lost. And now I've added one. It's just throwing candy at me. Although it's not worth a lot, but we pay 50 with two, 22 spare. We'll add a hooligan to break in. Now we get pizza the cat, which I'm going to take. So the cat's worth two. Oh, man. Okay. I mean, I think it probably was to do like the free one value cats that we had, you know, um, among other things. But that's life. Okay. Another, do I want another hooligan? I, I really don't. I'll just get a temporary two value symbol in the bubble instead. Um, I'm going to add a second crap. <laughs> I'm... I'm just... Listen, we'll get there, okay? At least we've got a second cultist now. So they're with, some, they were with zero before. Um, we'll get there. You know, I think it might take me a few days to get back into it, which will be good because obviously the, the full game comes out in a few days. Um, that's fine. I'm going to get Lucky 7, honestly. I think Ninja Mouse would have been a way better option there. But for some reason, I'm just addicted to Lucky 7s. Okay, third cultist. They're worth three each now. That's a lot better. That is a lot better. We've got um, happy hour, so the beverages are worth a little bit more. So we'll add a beer. When I say beverages, I don't think it applies to wine. No, sorry. <laughs> it does apply to wine. I don't think it applies to milk. No, because I guess humans really... It's not... I mean, people, people do drink milk. Don't get me wrong. Especially in their hot beverages all the time. And cold beverages. What am I on about? Cold brew, hot coffee, whatever you want. Um, but like people, you know... I guess this only applies to things that would be sold at happy hour, which makes more sense now that I say it. Because if you go to a happy hour and you ask for like, oh yeah, can I get two pints of milk, please? Um, probably just going to say no. <laughs> this is obviously really strong, but I don't feel like I want it. I don't want to do like an absolutely broken thing. Oh, talking of coffee. I'm going to take coffee just because it's there. We haven't got a guillotine, so no billy in there. I could have the jellyfish for now. Goldilocks, you may add this item and destroy. So you may destroy this item and add three bears. It's good for later on, isn't it? I'm gonna take it. I think that's a good. That's the best way to do a bear run, I think. Get Goldilocks and then like save it for for later until you actually get the beehive or the honey or whatever. Okay, we've we've, we've got to make something happen here. Uh, I'm gonna be honest. I like the three cultists. You know, two more wouldn't go, they wouldn't go amiss. They'd be great. So I'd like two more cultists at least. Um, I could add a full-size coconut with nobody to eat it. That seems like a really good idea. I've done that. Um, honestly, I think a dwarf to come and drink all the beverages that we're going to add. Maybe 
beer was a better option there, but oh, there you go. Never mind. We've added the beer anyway. It gets drank straight away. There's still two more on the board. Pinata for the toddler that I despise. In fact, there's two toddlers on the board. And you are correct in thinking that I do despise them both. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> let's pay, pay 225. 271 spare. I really shouldn't be adding more coconuts, but I am. Um, I mean, this is rare, so like, I should just add it. I'm not saying I should use it, but it's a rare symbol, so let's just take it. Uh, there is another toddler there. I'm going to take it, and I'm also going to go ahead and remove the coin. So I've got a few more things that we should remove first, like in the flower and the pearl aren't great, but added another toddler people okay this is quite good actually they have just demolished all of the candy i'm pretty sure i don't think there's any left on the board after that there might be like one or two there's another cultist we're on 21 symbols goodbye to the flower the pearl will be next to go i need something to come and eat the coconuts i made a grave mistake with adding that many coconuts the wine gets drank straight away by the dwarf let's go oh i've been offered a ninja and i didn't take ninja mouse i regret this decision i could add it though just to replace the pearl and then what's up next? The cherries, I think. I mean, I don't really want to get rid of the cat. But because we've got pizza, the cat. So I might just... I mean, we could always add it back later on if we were to get like a cat essence. But honestly, popsicle essence is really good. But I'm going to go instant ramen essence. I'm going to go dwarven anvil essence. Whenever wine or beer, ignore the ores. I don't really use the ores. Um, are destroyed by a dwarf. The dwarf gives 1.5 times more this game. And the chef would multiply said beverages. So I'm going to add a chef for now. I'm going to add a big symbol bomb. Which I don't really want any of these. I do want a monkey. Let's go. The coin will get removed by coin and a string. But we don't have coin and a string. So no, it won't. And we'll get another present. Okay. Let's let Havoc break loose. Monkey eats coconut and a half. Okay. Nice. 91 rolled. 350s due in seven. Added milk for the one cat that we have. I am brave sometimes, aren't I? I really am. I want to get rid of the cherry. I'm just going to wait for like all the other stuff to go before I re use a removal token. There's still like a lot of coconuts that need to be removed and stuff. I don't want to remove a cherry and then when all the coconuts disappear, we've actually got like a few empty spaces on the board. 350 for in free spins i mean we've smashed that this is much better than the last run and probably the last two runs before that as well um <laughs> okay i'm gonna take another cat it's two value it seems pretty cool i think now's maybe a good time to remove some stuff we pay 350 409 spare i'm gonna add honey which you're probably thinking you should add the bears i don't think we should adding three bears without a beehive is a little bit dangerous so i'm gonna say no I'll take a fruit basket. Removal token. We'll get rid of the cherries. And we have got two crabs. So I'm leaning towards that. But there's still a coconut to get rid of, I think. I think the crabs need to go. I just... I just... Yeah, let's just commit to it. You know, we haven't got anything that's really helping out the crabs right now. Let's get rid of them. We'll get rid of the coconuts. I would love another cap. It's got to be a fourth cultist, right? Make them all four value. Five value. We've got five, cult five cultists. Okay. And there is a bit of a cat, which I'm going to get instead of a coconut half. So I'm a little bit of a maniac there. And I think we're going to... Oh, my God, it's another coconut. <laughs> uh, okay, uh, this is getting a little bit out of hand. I, I can really do with some removal uh, tokens. Um, and also the monkey to eat all the coconuts, please. I want to get rid of some of these toddlers. Although if we remove you, we get a removal token back. So by you, I mean the jellyfish, by the way. I think... Our next removal token we get. Oh, I've got to add a bartender. I've got happy hour. I've got happy hour and dwarven anvil and a dwarf. I have to add a bartender. I just need conveyor belt now. Okay. We pay 425 with 49 free spare. I'm going to add grave robber essence, which does mean we can remove the hooligan if we've still got it. And I'm also going to go ahead and I'll take fertilizer. Not that I'm really going to use it. I'm going to roll here. Pinyard is a good pick one bear no i want a beehive there's a beehive okay this has gone insane uh i'm gonna get corn and a string because it's just a common item a blue item that i'd like to get rid of wealthy capsule okay so i guess now i could add the bees i mean the bears i feel like that would be a smart decision to do now 
And there's another bear. Oh, no. Why have I added another bear? It's going to give us four bears when I activate Goldilocks. Oh, there's another cultist. Oh, no. Oh, okay. Maybe we don't activate Goldilocks. Maybe that's our solution. We don't need four bears. We're only generating like one honey every like, I don't know. Is it 10%? Yeah, so like one honey every 10 spins on average. Do you know what I mean? So it's not worth adding four bears yet. And I keep adding coconuts, but I've got one monkey who's like not eating any because the board's so full. Okay, I need to get removal tokens and I need to remove, I think, the toddlers. I think that would be a good time. Oh no, we've got other things like the sapphires that can go. Okay, we pay 575. 434 four is spare. We didn't get any removal tokens. I will take an essence capsule though. I'll take triple coins, even though I'm not really going down a coin route. I did get removal tokens. There goes the jellyfish. That gives us one back. Let's get rid of the sapphire. Let's get rid of the hooligan because we've got grave rubber now as well. Oh no, we don't. We've only got the essence. Oh no. <laughs> uh, okay, it's fine. Ricky the banana from the item capsule. The cultists are probably going to win us this. I've added candy for the toddlers, even though I do want to get rid of them. And it's only worth like seven gold. We've got no items to really benefit it. I have got like three cats, but I'm not going to add the milk. Okay. Honey got multiplied by the chef. And then the bear ate the honey. I don't think it matters. He just gives 40 gold for each one. It doesn't matter if the honey itself's multiplied. It's the bear that needs to be multiplied to get the big increase. Okay, no worries. 625 and four spins. I'm feeling a lot more confident with this one, I'll be honest. But we never know what that boss fight's going to be like. He could do something crazy like cultists are now worth minus 100, you know. I don't think that's written into the game, but he could. He could. Um, anything that can happen will happen. Um, unless it's programmed into the game, <laughs> which it won't. I've got a removal token, but we've got a coconut half. I'm just thinking, if he eats that, that takes it down to 20, and then we're kind of even for a bit. I don't really want any of these, but I'll take Fruit Basket Essence. Destroys itself when there are at least three bears. When destroyed, bears give one more this game. Pizza the Cat Essence as well. It's very nice. There's the second beehive. Maybe it's time to go full full bees and bears. I've got a removal token. I might get rid of the ninja. I'm going to add beer for the dwarf. Yeah, let's get rid of the ninja. Okay, so I want the coconut half to go. Where now I'm thinking we get rid of the monkey. Because I'm... I know I might find it really hard to do this, but I want to stop adding coconuts. Um, oh, Dwarven Anvil Essence has just been activated. Oh, no. I'm saying no to it. I'm getting a buffing caption and said goodbye, coconuts. I want to get rid of this monkey fella. Okay, that's nice. That's nice. 161 rolled. A coin will get removed straight away. Thanks to coin and a string. I think I just saw some honey get added. Okay. Nice. If we can clear out the toddlers and replace them with the Goldilocks bears... We're going to be having a good time. I think. I just need a lot of removal tokens I don't have right now. <laughs> uh, please give me removal tokens. I don't think I'm going to get four before the boss fight, to be honest. I could add a Zaroff that would just come in and kill. I'll kill all the cultists as well. Yeah, that's not a vibe. Uh, let's pay 675 with 625 spare. 777 is due in 10. I'm going to roll, see if I can find a beehive. Um, I'm going to add quantum symbol bomb and see if I can find anything that's useful to us in here. Spoiler, I can't. Okay. Removal tokens. I'm going to get rid of the monkey and I guess for now, one of the toddlers. So there's still three left. Okay. We've got three beehives, but I need to add the... No, I don't need to add the bears. I want to add the bears because it would make a lot of money, but the board's just too messy for that right now. To be fair, the cats aren't great. I probably could get rid of a lot of cats, but I prefer cats to toddlers, and I think a lot of people do. Um, unless you've got a toddler, of course. No offense. <laughs> Some people out there right now, they're like, you know, their toddler sat next to them, and I'm just like slaying them. Um, I don't mean yours. <laughs> I just mean the whole population of toddlers in general. I'm joking. I just I prefer to have a cat. <laughs> um, okay. I think we've got a pretty good setup for this boss fight, apart from apart from the toddlers. Um, you know, not throwing shade again. I mean, you know what? It's out there now. I hate him. Um, I think if we are desperate with our Goldilocks, just because Goldilocks essence will proc and give us like 77 gold. But okay. 
nice 108 we're gonna pay 777 with 690 spare and we're into the boss fight so we got to deal 750 damage to the boss or pay 1000 rent i'm taking max or the bear essence oh my god yes i'm taking credit card i'm taking another beehive i'm taking gray pepper even though i don't have any removal tokens okay please give me like a removal capsule option here or another beehive that'd be pretty good um no okay there isn't really anything here uh worthwhile so i'm just gonna go ahead and add a uh i'm gonna re-roll it so i'm gonna do i'm gonna re-roll it i was hoping for a removal capsule i don't have any so we're just gonna go item capsule that was a waste okay multiplied and eaten again max with the bear essence comes into play 95 gold for that bear oh my god this guy doesn't stand a chance I can't believe it took me like, you know, 40 minutes to beat floor one and three attempts, more importantly, to beat floor one. Wait, beehives no longer trigger their chance base effects, which means no more honey can be added and their hex of destruction just destroyed one of my beehives. I mean, I'm pretty sure we're safe, but that's, that's annoyed me. That's annoyed me. <laughs> uh no thank you we could, i mean we could add candy because we've got all the toddlers but 246 damage has got to be dealt we're going to deal that over time right we just dealt 70 without even thinking about it added another cultist he's just added a dud on floor one hex of destruction has just destroyed my dwarf well it's time for him to die i think maybe not just yet maybe next turn yeah yeah okay now it's time for him to die i've added another bear i'm gonna add gold deluxe face the full wrath of the bears let's go okay we did it people so that's our return um happy new year hope you all had a good holidays hope you all had a good break if you took time off um but that's gonna be it, i think for today pretty good run in the end um i had another bartender that's oh my god i'll add a lucky carrot to take a look um pretty good run in the end to be honest uh you know toddlers and cultists and whatnot kind of the standard from me um the new game the new game sorry the full game comes out in three days so over the next three days uh we're going to be playing you know just through the floors so like we'll do floor two maybe three tomorrow um and then when the full game comes out we're going to be achievement hunting for those 100 and something steam achievements that are being added and then after that we'll go to mods i've been promising mods for a while now but can't get achievements when there's mods enabled so um but yeah I'm just happy we got loads of content, to be honest. Uh, thank you all for watching. I hope you had a nice break once again. Um, I am back now. I'm going to try and get back on the grind with the videos and streaming. So make sure to check out the links down below or subscribe if you're new. But apart from that, goodbye.